In May, three Nigerian men were indicted for committing sexual extortion against young men and teens in the Western District of Michigan and across the United States. And as of yesterday, two of them had been extradited to the U.S. to face charges. One of them is accused in the death of Marquette, Michigan teen Jordan DeMay. In the first alert update, Samantha Cavalli brings us the latest on the investigation. Bill and Cammie, in March of 2022, 17-year-old Jordan DeMay was found dead with a self-inflicted gunshot wound, prompting an investigation by the Marquette County Sheriff's Department and the FBI. Now, over a year later, 22-year-old Samuel and 20-year-old Samson Ogashi are having their day in federal court. Nigerian authorities arrested the two brothers in January at the request of the United States. A grand jury says the men bought hacked social media accounts and used them to pose as young women to lure the teens into sexual chats. They say they got the teens to send sexually explicit images and later threatened to send them to other people unless the victims paid them money. DeMay's mother, Jennifer Buda, praised the work of the investigators in a complicated international case. The fact that they did this, they found the people, they were able to um, arrest them and bring them here is amazing. It's absolutely amazing and um, I think it's very fitting for Jordan's story that this happened. The third Nigerian man, 19-year-old Ezekiel Robert, has yet to be extradited to the United States from Nigeria. He, along with the Ogashi brothers, are facing numerous charges that include conspiracy to sexually exploit minors, conspiracy to distribute child pornography, and conspiracy to commit stalking through the Internet. Now, if convicted, each suspect could face decades in prison. In the newsroom, Samantha Cavalli, Action 2 News.